This is JC Masterpiece. <clears throat> we are playing Mario Kart Tour, and this is the Baby Daisy Cup, but it is the ranked version of the Baby Daisy Cup. Normally, you'll see me do first runs <clears throat> showing how I got a really good score on a first run set. But this time, we are doing a ranked run, so that means that the scores here <coughs> are four optimized for best, for the most points, the best score overall. Okay, so a lot of times with these races, <coughs> what you're looking for is your loadout, your character, your cart, your glider are as important, sometimes if not more important, than doing everything perfectly. Oh, and I messed that one up. <coughs> okay, so here we go. <coughs> so one thing you gotta remember is having good cards, good characters, does count a lot for high scores. But what you'll notice with this, with this ranked cup, this first ranked cup, is that <coughs> you can get a ton of really good carts, the really, the really good carts, really good players, all that, a lot of them are ones you could have gotten early on. So if you've been playing from day one, even if you haven't gotten a lot of the top tier things, of uh, the um, exclusives for each group, you can still get a good loadout just by, over time, having built up a good team. Flame Flyer is one example. <coughs> Oop, frenzies help a ton too. <coughs> Getting these frenzies, most of the people, most of the scores you see, top scores you see, only exist because the people that were playing them have had frenzies. Okay. So, but anyways, the, um, like Dry Bowser's been around since the first. He has not been an, a, an exclusive only to one set. So as a result, I've had him for a while. <coughs> okay, 10,270 points gets me through that. With my team. Okay. So moving on to the second track. Got Mario, level one. Got Pipe Frame, which is level two, and then the Super Glider. So obviously Pipe Frame and Super Glider are ones that have been here for a while. They are the most basic ones to start off with. You can't get much more basic than these ones. So catching these drifts, catching these curves, catching these items for these combos is important. Obviously, Frenzy, again, for my um, for my ranked races, these are the ones that put me in a very high position. That's the second time we've seen a Frenzy, second race in a row with a Frenzy. And... Hit a red, sh hit it, got hit by a blue shell. We got another frenzy. Helps to offset that. So that's two frenzies in one race. Okay. <coughs> so that brings me, that brings me at the end of the second race with another 6,452 points. In this case, lots of runs, lots of practice, lots of options got me two frenzies in one race, even though I got hit by a blue shell. Okay. Got Baby Daisy, want high, a high-ranking character so you can get the three items for frenzies, Super Blooper and Parasol. Off we go. Catching this curve. Underwater. Here we go. 
Bounce off of the shell, get the item from the other shell, and I'm gonna shoot for this edge. I've been practicing these edge, and I missed it. So in spite of the fact of making a mistake, this is still one of my best runs. This is still actually my best run that I'm showing you here. So I could have done better by getting the coin and getting the ramp on that one, because it'll actually have me fly over everything and I get even more bonus points. <coughs> but I made a mistake there, but I still survived through it. Okay, you'll notice again with this third race, a frenzy. Lots and lots and lots and lots of extra bonus points with this frenzy. Keep building up this frenzy and keep things going. The best way to get frenzies, well obviously you need a three, um, uh, a three tier car character in order top tier character in order to get the three items um, and just you just keep playing and playing and playing and playing until you get it so 8708 on that race and that'll bring me to my final points you'll notice that I am not in first place overall as a result of these races <coughs> 8708 new record um, I am in tier 17 right now, so three away from the very top you can possibly be right now. And that brought me to 25,000, 23,000, excuse me. But we also have a bonus for you. I also have a bonus for you. So we are going to, I'm going to show you another race, the Dino Dino Jungle. This second time doing this race, I want you to see this is my second best overall run. And with this second best run, you'll see a problem that I run into <coughs> near the end that could have sabotaged me and could have completely destroyed it. So we want to get, obviously, as many of these items, catch the drifts, Catch the pull, the extra bonus. Got a frenzy again. This time it's a banana frenzy. So every one of these amazing, every one of these best runs that I have has at least one frenzy. So I took an early start. Getting that early start makes a difference. It puts me ahead of the pack. And if I can stay ahead of the pack, then I can get these um, these combos and really build up the combos in order to do well. Oh, got King Boo with a banana. Got a red shell coming at my tail, protecting my tail. Firing off my other green shell in hopes of hitting somebody. Here we go. So far I'm at 5,000. <coughs> 140 points go, going on up catching as many of these bounces as I can catch the edge of these to get the bounces you really don't want to hit the water if you don't have to if anything that can mess you up a little bit but I'm getting the bounces I'm getting the extra combos as a result okay around the gonna come around the curve and finish here's the problem I run into blue shell right near the end of all of these four races that I've shown you, three of them have had me being attacked by a blue shell. One of them I caught a frenzy and didn't get hit by the blue shell but making a mistake having a problem does not guarantee a poor score. You can still come back from bad from bad situations. This one got me to 9804 remember my, my best score was over 10,000. Okay, so this has been JC Masterpiece, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I will try to keep making these. Thank you, and have a great day, everybody.